Hi everyone, this is Sebastiano of CodyHouse.co. Okay, so in this quick tutorial, I want to show you how you can use uh, the text component class of the CodyHouse framework and change the vertical rhythm of your uh, text containers. Okay, so first of all, we are looking at the text component class. You'll find this class inside the uh, typography global file. Uh, so this class is used to target uh, con text containers. So anytime you want to uh, use some text elements uh, together, you can use this class, which is going to apply some basic inline style. So it's going to take care of uh, uh, margins, for example, and settings other styles as well. One really cool thing that you can do using this, uh, this class is managing uh, the vertical rhythm of your text components. So uh, what does it mean? Uh, you can see right here we have a few CSS variables. So the two important variables you have to uh, look at are the line height multiplier and the text vspace multiplier. So the line height multiplier is injected into the body line height and the heading line height variables, which means that if we change the line height multiplier, we affect all of the line height of the other elements. While the text vSpace multiplier, uh, as you can see right here, is injected into the margin bottoms uh, applied to all the elements of the text components which once again means that if we do change the text vSpace multiplier, we change the vertical spacing as well. So just to give you a practical example, if I change this value here from 1 to 1.2, if you check the demo, you can see the line height uh, is bigger than before and it's affecting the heading elements and the paragraphs as well and all the other elements of the typography. So we can uh, increase the line height a lot and then have some uh, really uh, high line height. And uh, okay, it's not great to look at, but this is just to give you an example of what you can do. While if we change the text vSpace multiplier from one to two, for example, uh, you can see that we are increasing the margins of the elements. So you can use these uh, variables um, uh, together and change the vertical rhythm of your uh, text components like that, for example. So why this is useful? Because um, you have different kind of text components across your website. Sometimes you want to squeeze the content and make it, make it look smaller by decreasing the line height or reducing the margins. In other cases, you want to increase the line height and the vertical space. Uh, generally, you have to create a different classes and in each class you have to change the margin bottoms of each one of your uh, elements uh, of, the, of the text component and you have to do the same for the line height. While by using these two variables, you can target any class you want and uh, modify the whole vertical spacing just by changing the values of these two variables. Okay, so this is all you need to know about changing the vertical rhythm of your text components. And uh, I hope you guys enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.